Hello students, welcome to Magis classes. In this video, we are going to discuss about the volume 2, plus 2 chemistry, unit number 13. Evaluate yourself part. That is in the page number 207. The first one, draw the structure of the following compounds. So, writing structure, the first one is the neopentylamine, it is a common name. Tertiary butylamine, it is a common name. Alpha amino propionaldehyde, also common name. Tribenzylamine, common name. And this is a N-methyl, N-methyl, hexane 3 amine So, from the formula, the common name and from, from the IUPS name, we can easily find out the or classify the amines. We have discussed in the previous video how to classify the amines by using the formula common name and IUPS name. Here we are going to write the structures. The first one neopentylamine. Neopentylamine is a primary amine because it consists of only one alkyl group attached to the amine part. And what is the neopentyl group? So we know very well that the isopropyl group. It is an isopropyl group. Clear? In isopropyl group, the second carbon consists of one methyl group. This is iso. It is iso group. What is neo group? The second carbon consists of two methyl group. Okay. Neo pentyl is this one. Five carbons. Suppose you are going to write neo hexyl one additional CH2. It is very simple. So it is neo pentyl to which the NH2 is attached. So this is a formula. Clear? See the second one, tertiary butylamine. Tertiary butylamine also primary amine because it has only one alkyl group, primary amine. And what is tertiary butyl? Tertiary butyl having this group. So this is tertiary butyl group. Okay, to which the NH2 is added. So it is tertiary butyl amine. And third one, alpha amino propionaldehyde. Propionaldehyde having three carbon atom and one aldehyde group. The carbonyl group is always in the first carbon. So it is propionaldehyde. And here the alpha carbon, that is a amino group. What is alpha carbon? This is the alpha carbon. The alpha carbon is nothing. It is a carbon to which the functional group is attached. So it is alpha and it is beta. And from number it is 1, it is 2, it is 3. But the alpha position is a position to which the functional group is attached. So in alpha part 1, amino group is attached. So instead of one hydrogen atom, here you can write one amino group. Clear? It is alpha amino propionaldehyde. Okay, fourth one. Fourth one is a tribenzyl amine. It has three alkyl part, three aryl part, and so it is tertiary amine. Tertiary amine, what is the functional part? N. So it is a N to which three benzyl groups are attached. What is benzyl group? C6H5, CH2 is the benzyl part, and C6H5 is the phenyl. So benzyl. So the benzyl is attached here. CH2, C6H5. CH2, C6H5. CH2, C6H5. So this is, it is a tribenzyl amine. Okay. The fifth one. The fifth one, the IUPS name is given. So IU, from the IUPS part, alkane amine is present. It is a primary amine. N substituted, N substituted alkylamine, it is a secondary amine. Here the 2 N is substituted and so it is tertiary amine. So tertiary amine has the functional part N. Two one N ethyl, N methyl, hexane 3 amine. So it is a tertiary amine, it has 2 N parts. So hexane 3 amine. So one part is the hexane, CH3, CH2, CH, to which the amino part is there. CH2, CH3. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. So it, it will be CH2 and CH3. To the nitrogen atom, one ethyl group is attached, CH2, CH3, and one methyl group is attached. 
So this is the n ethyl n methyl hexane 3 amine. Okay. The second one give the correct IUPAC names of the following amines. Give the correct IUPAC names of the following amine. The first one is the amine consists of uh, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 and the functional group is primary amine. Primary amine NH2, secondary amine NH, tertiary amine N. So it is a number 1 and it is 2, 3, 4, 5. So long chain consists of 5 carbon atom. So it is pentane. Pentane. E, the suffix is removed. And in the second carbon, there is a amine. So it is pentane amine. Pentane 2 amine. Okay. And from the formula, it has NH and so it is a secondary amine. Secondary amine is named in the IUPAC nomenclature as this N substituted amine, alkane amine. Here one is the butyl group. It is a butyl group and it is a methyl group. So butane is taken as amine. So the N is substituted with the methyl group. It is a smaller group. N methyl and the long chain consists of four carbon atom butane and in the second place the amino group is attached so butane 2 amine clear then it is the primary amine so it is alkane amine here the cyclohexane is present and so it is cyclohexane amine first of all it is 6 carbon 1 2 3 4 5 6 and it is cyclic but cyclo Examine. And fourth one it is a benzene ring and it is amine part. In the first carbon atom it is 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. The third position the amine is present. And in the first place the hydroxyl group is present. Okay. So it is 3 amino. The third carbon amino part is present. 3 amino phenol. And the fifth one, it is a tertiary amine, it has nitrogen is a characteristic group and to which two phenyl group and one is the alkane amine. So it is M, comma, N, diphenyl, benzene amine or aniline, benzene amine, benzene. The E is removed, benzene. Okay. So, in general, for naming the compound, the primary amine consists of the common system, the alkane amine. You have to remember that. And the secondary amine has N alkyl substituted, N methyl alkane amine or L alkane amine. It is alkyl part. And the tertiary amine consists of two NN substitution with the alkane amine. So, by using this, you can easily in the compounds. Okay, students, this is the end of the slide. I hope that it is useful to you. Thank you for watching.